Welcome to episode two of the Brush High School Principal Podcast. Today's topic, the happenings at Charles F. Brush High School. The school year started and we are excited for the work that is taking place in our classrooms. Our teachers and staff members at Brush have been working hard in preparing engaging lessons for our students, as well as developing positive relationships with our students so that they can be successful in our classrooms. Some of the great work happening in our classrooms include our brand new state-of-the-art innovation lab for STEM. Mr. Spano and Mr. Rantz are doing amazing work with our students in the brand new STEM class. Earlier today, I was watching students literally construct towers using various pieces of equipment, wooden pieces, and limited directions. Students are excited for the happenings of this class, and it shows in their overall willingness to participate each and every day. Some of the equipment that is available for our students in the Innovation Lab include the following. The amazing 3D print farm. The industrialized laser engraver. The dirty room where there are brand saws, CNC routers, and belt sanders. The lab is full of desktop computers. There is an interactive whiteboard, a garment printer, and an embroidery station, all for the use of our students. Thank you, Mr. Spano and Mr. Ranta and all our students for actively using this equipment. As well, this year, Brush is excited to have a new social justice and racism class, which is being co-taught by Mrs. Kelly and Mrs. Watkins-Clark. This is a semester course for seniors and juniors as we attempt to build this course into a course that all students will have at Brush High School. The topics that are being presented throughout the course include the following. Labels and identity. Justice for all. Into the Republic, which it stands. The condition and critical thinking and finding your agency. We are proud of this course as this brings the worlds of both social studies and language arts to the forefront as we address the societal issues facing our students. We know that being a student or a young person or an adult in general in today's society is not an easy thing. And hopefully this new course will help prepare our students for what it's gonna be like when they leave Brush High School. Other happenings on campus include the Career Connections courses that are taking place for students in grades 9, 11, and 12 as we begin to prepare students for life after high school. Ms. Levy is introducing our ninth grade students the various career clusters that are available to them after graduation. To fully understand the career clusters, our students are completing career inventories to better understand what their personal interests and likes are so they can better choose a future career. Students in grade 11 and 12 are experiencing the work of Mrs. Bram, who is developing ideas for how students will earn their careers, whether it is through career technical education or programs, college, the military, or even the workforce. We are so proud of this program as it is literally changing the lives of our students here at Brush High School. You'll notice that students in grade 10 are missing this year. Please know that we are literally developing this program for 10th graders so that we can implement for the 22-23 school year. As you can see, we have been busy the first two weeks of school. There are plenty of exciting happenings coming up, which include the following. The Linhurst Home Days is the weekend of September 10th through the 12th, and Brush will be represented by all our students and groups actively participating in the likes of the upcoming Pancake Breakfast, which will support the Brush High School After Prom Committee. Our marching band will be performing in the Home Days Parade, as will all our fall sports teams and any student wanting to volunteer. Our Brush Open House is Monday, September 13th, and will take place here at the high school from 6.30 to 8 p.m. Information regarding Open House will be shared electronically, so parents please look for upcoming emails from my office. While preparing for all these upcoming events, we have Homecoming Weekend coming up relatively soon. That will be taking place the weekend of September 24th and 25th. The Homecoming Assembly is scheduled for Friday, September 24th in Welser Gym. The big football game will take place later that day, hosting Willoughby South at 7 p.m. in Corb Field. Then our weekend will conclude with the homecoming dance, which is taking place Saturday, September 25th from 6 to 1030. 
This year, this dance will only be for Brush students as we are dealing with the effects of COVID. More information to follow soon. To all our members of the Brush community, we want you to make today the best day. Continue to be safe in our protocols of COVID prevention, where we are strongly recommending wearing a mask on campus, washing hands regularly, and limiting our distance from others. If you need to get a hold of me, please remember, contact my office, 216-691-2068, and I can be reached by email, williamson at sel.k12.oh.us. Arc Nation, thank you for everything you've done up to this point. Let's make today the best day. Have a great weekend. You have been listening to a Charles F. Brush High School AVTV Productions podcast at the South Eucalyptus Schools, the destination school community.